I'm just I'm just messing around. I don't know. I'm just uh, doing a thing, just beaming, just streaming. Uh, kind of just uh, you know I don't know. I need to get a new stream overlay, right? I mean, I had that one that Ian made for Extra Life and kind of liked the look of that generally. But then, I don't know, you go look at other stream overlays and it's all just like sites trying to sell you overlays that are designed to look like your favorite video games. Like, give us 13 pounds sterling and we'll give you this Battleborn skin. I'm like, I, no, I don't, no one, no one needs any of that. So, I don't know, I'll probably just... Grab a copy of Photoshop here, I guess. Grab my Mac. I think it's installed on there. Pixelmator or something like that and just uh, come up with something dumb. Oh, man. Lex Luthor blew up the bridge. Just like I knew he would. There he is, though. Got him on his jetpack. We're gonna put him in jail. As soon as I can find the jail. Go in the subway. We can, right there it is. There's the jail. And we got his buddy, too. We got two guys in jail. We got a bridge piece now. Lois Lane being carried by a helicopter. I... I have a disgusting appreciation for this game that no one should have, honestly. Like, this is a ridiculous product. It's insane that it exists at all. I can't find... There it is. Okay, one piece to the, delivered the bridge. We got another guy here. All right, three criminals and two bridge pieces. There's a bridge piece. Oh, crit tonight. No, get the... Okay. There's the third bridge piece. But we can only carry one thing at a time. You know how it goes. Uh, up. Okay, there's the phone booth. That means that the bridge is right here. Oh, wait, wait. What happened to my bridge piece? Did the helicopter steal it? You... Never, I, oh, okay. I got hit by the kryptonite, but Lois Lane was right there to cure me of it. This is this is probably the only Superman thing I like, also, and like is maybe a strong word. If it's not obvious that when it makes that when it makes this crazy noise, that's me holding down the button because you can use that to see the screens in all four directions. So I can hold down the button and push a direction and see what the next screen is, so I'm kinda of looking around trying to figure out where I need to be going. So the jail. I just keep going in one direction. I'll have to hit it, right? Yeah. Okay, we got two pieces to the bridge at the bridge. We need to find that third piece. There it is. That's, I just went to exactly where I was. Okay, bridge is back together, but there's still three criminals on the loose. Two criminals, and we're done. Wait, there's one. I just got just hanging out with Kryptonite. Got him. Damn it. Okay. 
Okay, there's just one criminal on the loose somewhere. We will find him. Oh, we will find him. Ah! Oh. Maybe we'll just carry Lois Lane around with us for a while. There, there, where, there. You, down, you. No, alright. All right, that's everybody. Now we just need to go back to the phone booth. Turn back into Clark Kent and then walk to the bridge. And walk to work. Do, 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 do. <laughs> we win. I'm the greatest Superman player on the internet. No. That's not I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna pretend that that's the case. I'm just screwing around with video games. I don't yeah, I, I don't know. I uh got this stuff. Could probably use a better overlay, like I was saying, but uh, you know. If you've found this stream then that's okay hello hi just kind of screwing around bomber king bomber man for the msx what does bomber man look like on an msx oh right this is original bomber man Bomberman, everyone's favorite. We win. Act Zero should have just been a recreation of... It should have been like a, a, re, a remake of this game. This Bomberman with his fucking hat. Look at him. Just happy little bomber man. I don't know. Just some dude. Like, hey, I'm Steve. You might know me as the bomber man. I just leave? Oh. I think it's pretty screwed up that the enemies can just walk through the bombs. It seems like something that, you know, a key piece of Bomberman, like, rules that they had not established yet at this time. Seems like I can just drop infinite bombs too. Man, some of these games have achievements. Uh, 
through retro achievements. I don't know how much, how well that all works. That's a small window. Right, you can spin on the jump, yeah. I remember being crazy, like, how good this game was at the time. Nowadays, the control is just not where you want it to be. It's a little flaky, but that does not work at all. readable thing in the world. Just, just poor, just poor work on my part there. Awkward. Well, whatever. I have to assume the achievements are not working because it hasn't popped any yet, and I would figure there would at least be some easy ones in place for, like, you got the fire flower. what everyone loves about Mario, these sick mazes of levels. It's just like, I gotta run back, I guess. I went the wrong way. That's, that's why we're here.
Ring that bell. Oh no. Oh no. Whoa. Ah. Whatever. Seems kind of easy to just fly. Like, kind of forever. Which is actually kind of neat. I don't know. It's, it's cool. Whoa. Also, they show you where the pipes lead, which is a super weird thing. Did I find a secret exit? Does this game have secret exits? This game totally has secret exits. I don't remember that at all. Smash this button and kind of fly forever. I'm barely dropping. Thanks, Tree Zone. That's great, an auto scrolling level. Well, let's stop. Is that going to make it too big? No. Okay. All right. That'll still work. Oh, wait. Did it? That's a hassle. Not too big a deal, I guess. I keep telling myself that one day I'll go back to Biomotor Unitron and play it some more. It's Pokemon both robot parts and robot fighting, kind of. It's kind of a cool game. Uh, 
was the name of that game? I mean, I guess I could always just play some some of this. This is it's a hot video game right here. Just looking, eyeballing it to make sure it's not getting cut off on the stream here. I mean, I guess I could just do one of these every time. I wonder if there's a way to just force a specific window size without doing full screen. Yeah, that works well enough. This is a hot stream right here. Just streaming this game. I can push up and turn that light on. I can push down, make those bugs appear. I can push right and make that hand come. Push left and nothing. Take it, you fucker. If I just, I think if I just start moving the D-pad around in all directions, he'll eventually freak out. Is that? All right, if I hit A, he'll do that. Run to the screen. All right, we're fifty percent of the way towards building our first mini game. We have to annoy him more. Oh, he's off to work. I think that means he's going to go build the mini games. Get out there! All right, he's back. All right, so I was swirling the D-pad, made that fall from the sky and hit him. Yeah. Let's see who else comes by. Oh, little dog! I hit the button too many times and it blew up the door. Now the door's broken. Let's uh, check our progress here. 30 percent, ten percent. Okay, so something, something's happening. This game's awesome, but I also never really actually understood it. I think if I get him to run to the, if I check this enough times, the door will like it'll eventually reset. No, I mean, yes, no, I don't know. All right, Ganbare Neo Poke Kun. Perhaps that's enough for now. Uh, I eventually opened up all, all the mini games uh, in this um, on in the on the cartridge I have in the other room somewhere. I need to force like some kind of screen reset. Uh, but I don't know how to do that with the to get the door back. Basically, if I can blow up the room or or something, I forget. I forget what it is. There we go. Swirl the D-pad long enough to flood the place. Oh, door's still broken. If I push to the left, it makes that 
crazy jack-o'-lantern face appear in the upper left and do stuff. Down makes those bugs appear. Up and down still turns the light on and off. And right makes the hand appear. But B doesn't do anything anymore because the door is broken. Yeah, it's flooded again. Fuck it. Very itchy. Let's let's check. Fifty, fifty, thirty, twenty, ten. I don't know how he's gonna leave to go to work with no door. I don't know what I gotta do to I mean, I could stop playing this. That's probably the best option, honestly. All right. I swirled enough to make that happen. That's right. That's right. Cry. Cry for me. There's a fact for this game on Game Facts that I feel like I've, I read every five years to see if... I will gain any new insight into how this game goes, but it, it never comes. The insight never, never comes. There, okay, the door's back. Hey! Who else? Oh, hello. And now he appears to be masturbating the hard way. Let's go to the bathroom, I guess. I mean, there's a bathroom right there. I also want to say this game uses the real-time clock in some way, but I could just be crazy. I had... I would be pretty psyched if I opened the door and there was just an elephant trunk coming in. I would probably jump up and down and dance. Whoa. Working out? Yeah. Get tough. making progress on these mini games as well but none of them are done okay so now we, we instead of the uh, getting guests we now have a speaker on the door so we can just hit the button to make noises at him is he eating the bugs on the ground is that Let me hit it anymore. I won't let me use the speaker anymore. It's been too long, I don't remember.
lot of terrific Neo Geo pocket color fight. Well, terrific is maybe so some good, some good portable fighting games for its time. Not need. I made a giant snake come. Uh, I made a giant snake appear. These games just, they, the, the moves flow out in a way that definitely, like, you didn't get a lot of, a lot of out of a lot of other uh, um, portable fighting games, you know? Like, you kind of, you know, compared to, like, something like, well, there were some okay Game Boy fighting games, but, like, most of them were rotten. You know, you think about, like, Mortal Kombat on the Game Boy. I want to fucking see some madness. Now this is a terrible this is a terrible fucking game. I guess like probably impressive for by the Game Boy standards, right? I mean, I remember having this game and playing more of it than I ever should have. I guess we we'll go with Scorpion. the spear come out on the first try. Like, imagine if they just redrawn all these characters and instead of like adhering to the fucking digitized look, 
and just made a good ass Mortal Kombat game for a portable platform. How neat that would have been. Instead of this, this horrible piece of shit. that spear come out again. Got it the first try and never again. Control is as unre uh, unresponsive as it looks. Like it just every piece of this game feels like total trash. Can't. What about Mortal Kombat 2? Was that better? Any better on the Game Boy? I'm gonna say no. I'm going to say almost certainly not. You know, I, this feels like a like world's better. And, and, and look at it, you know, they... They read it the graphics, and it's not trying to... Well, I, maybe they could have pulled it off. I don't know. But, but... I'm not going to sit here and tell you this game is good, but compared to Mortal Kombat 1 on the Game Boy, this is... Amazing. Game Boy Wrestling Games, Jesus. Six bones. That's all you need. So we have Sting and then the Steiner brothers. I'm watching World War 3 97 over here and it's the Steiner brothers like it's this must just be like just pre Big Papa Pump like he's kind of got his hair in a ponytail he's he's grown some facial hair like you tell he's he's trying to go someplace with it but hasn't yet All right, this is just the computer plan I, I got to get in here uh, single match sure professional this is time limit of course minute time no just, you know Ron Simmons okay sting yes Steve Austin uh, 
Dustin Rhodes, big Van Vader. Steiners. Did this come out when Ric Flair was in WWF? Is that seems like a kind of a glaring omission here. Well, I mean, you know, this is gonna go with Stone Cold, obviously. That's Can I mirror match? Yeah, looks like it. Boy, oh boy. How do I get up? Get up! I, he's just fucking rolling over and over. There we go. Oh God, to the outside. Just keep throwing Rick Root outside the ring. It's disqualification. No! Damn it, Rick Rude. N no, I, I, it's just number of falls in five minutes. That's how all wrestling matches were back then, right? That's, yeah, totally. Actually, I guess WCW did do a lot of, like, dumb shit like that for a while, didn't they? All I seem to be able to do is body slam. I'm not really finding any other controls here or other other moves Let's stick with what works I guess oh yep pin him outside good going Steve Yeah, that's right. Even it up. I All right, WWF Superstars has to be the earliest one, right? I mean, Rare made this game, so it has to be good, right? Perfection comes at a price. The price will be defeat. 
classic Mr. Perfect promo. It will be an easy win, and you can take it to the bank. See, because he's the million, he's the million dollar. Your chances of beating me aren't worth two cents. Man, this is vicious back and forth mic work. I tip big, and here is my tip for you, Mr. Perfect. Go home while you still can. I, I feel like saying he tips big is not in line with the DiBiase character. This, it's looking bad. Fuck, what? It's a pretty good little Vince McMahon. Hair color doesn't seem right. That's, that's got to be like a little Vince McMahon, right? It's just like laughing as Bret Hart puts his glasses on a kid in the crowd like, ha, 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 yes! Let's try the sequel, WWF Superstars 2. Brain. No, that, did, that, that, is, that could not have been Brain. The body was too built for that to be Heenan. Oh, this looks way worse. We got it, guys. We got more realistic bodies in here. What's that you say? The game plays like garbage? Yeah, well, well I mean, cage match, obviously. Easy computer. Everyone's favorite Sid Justice TM. Very ominous. Is the fucking Mountie? I pick six wrestlers when you're making this game. When did this game come out? 92. Hey guys, it's 1992. We need to figure out who, which six wrestlers we're gonna put in this game. Well, I mean Hogan and Macho Man, right? I mean we gotta put those guys in here. Uh, you know we like Jake a lot. We're big on Undertaker. Uh, you know Sids and stuff. And how about I don't know the Mountie? Sure. Sir, sir. Look at this is. It's a nice touch. Such a vicious tie up here. Oh, man. Whoa, what, how, why did he just get all his health back? I feel like I just drained like a like a ton of his life just kicking him over and over again. And then he was just like, by the way, I'm Jake the Snake.
kicked that man in the face a thousand times and then pinned him. That's how all wrestling matches should go. Once you get him down, just kick him over and over again and don't let up until he's dead and then pin him. Yes, yeah, start over. All right. So then King of the Ring probably came after that, and then I bet Raw, if I had to guess. Gray Matter did this one. Gray Matter did B.O.B. on the SNES. All right, the narcissists. We didn't get to hear. So far, I feel like Mr. Perfect's music has been the only one that's been recognizable as Mr. Perfect. As no, hey, I'll wait. Look at this drawing of fucking Scott Hall. The gigantic chin. All right, this is yeah. I mean, there's a lot of wrestlers in this game. What? I want. I don't want to be me. I want to be Razor Ramon. Oh God! Look at this game. <laughs> happening here look at these guys fuck i feel like i'm like if you look at this meter like i'm doing no damage This seems bad. Uh. All right, so we did King of the Ring, we did both Superstars games, let's do Raw.
Real Time Associates. All right. They did um Balls? Do they do balls that fighting game? Is that real time associates? I want to select the opponent. All right, so we got Luger, Bret Hart, Shawn Michaels, Razor, Yokozuna, Undertaker, Doink, and Diesel. Height near seven feet. Oh, we. Oh, so we. Okay, so we, if we hold it here, we can get the music. Diesel Razor matchup you've been waiting for. But the cool thing about games, uh, you know, of this era were, and I guess it's still true today in some cases, but, you know, these were all technically sequels to one another made by the same publisher. Different lines and different developers and stuff like that. And it's great to see the quality just completely all over the place. Like, some game, you know, you'll, you'll get, like, Superstars 1. Like, oh, it controls okay. Like, there's just zero lineage other than the license. And this game fucking sucks way worse than even the one we were playing before it. Uh, even if it maybe looks a little better. I don't know. It's hard to, I don't even know what that necessarily that it looks a little better. This is fucking trash. All right, and then to go all the way into this has to be the last one, right? I mean, yeah, 98, 1998, a Game Boy game in 1998. And I guess there would be some Game Boy Color games. So I should look. All right. Probe. Crawfish Interactive. Yes, let's take the WWF Challenge. Kane. Ken Shamrock. Austin. Farouk. Gold Dust. Triple H. What is it? Mm -hmm. Mankind. Owen Hart. Rocky. My Via. Bulldog, Ahmed Johnson, The Undertaker. And I'm going to go with Steve Austin here. Owen Hart, the current world champ. we got to work our way up the ladder here. You best be afraid. Very afraid. Stand up, you dick. I mean, up and down. Uh, up and down just kind of rolls on the mat. So, oh, you got me from behind. Vicious. I don't... There we go. I'm getting nothing in. This just, this feels bad, and I've been pinned, and no, I don't want to continue. I lost. Okay. Uh, what do we got on the Game Boy Color? I mean, there's probably, like, years more of this sort of stuff, right? Was there a WCW game? 
Yeah. Oh, Mayhem, the fucking EA game. Yikes. Two thousand. Seems like all the music is coming out of the left speaker and all the audio is coming out of the right. That's cool. Yes, the quest for the best. Scorpion Deathlock. Hollywood Hogan. Finisher move. Big boot to the face. Not the leg drop. The big boot. Buff Bagwell. Perfect. Bam Bam. Booker T. Lex Luger. Savage. Nash. DDP. Good looking Bret Hart. No Scott Hall. Guess by the year 2000, maybe. Is that when Hall was already like kind of not showing up? No showing events and stuff? Oh, boy. Let's go with Goldberg. He's so hot right now. Worked for Mortal Kombat. Let's put a fat scroll in it, I guess. Oh, man. Hey, this is a pretty fast-moving game. I'll give it that. So that's a perfect-looking Bret Hart. Pretty much just him. Is this an FMV game? I can't even tell anymore because of how accurate that Bret Hart is. Uh, can I do moves? Can either of us do moves? I mean, I guess, like, again, true to life, Goldberg not big on doing moves. Okay, so select is pause here. So I wonder if that means start does something. Sometimes in games like these, they're just like, fuck it. Make the start button a button. We need more than two buttons. I'm not even sure what I'm doing to make that pin happen. Hey! What? That looked good. She just run away. Bret Hart just had enough. That's so Bret Hart. Always just like taking it outside the ring and just taking matters into his own hands and taking advantage of the situation, you know. <laughs> I love the security camera look. What is that dude doing laying down? What is going on back here? We win. Hooray.
then it just goes right to the okay that's that's all that anyone could ever want to see oh betrayal is that fucking crazy ass that's very readable All right, do you want to be The Rock, Triple H, Undertaker, or Steve Austin? Say we'd be The Rock. It looks like The Rock really has Triple H on the ropes. We may have ourselves a new heavyweight champion. Oh no! What? Figures. There's nothing like whooping on the rock. Steve Austin is always saying that. Triple H agrees more or less. That's what happens when you play the game. Apparently these refs want to fucking fight. All right. Wait, Rock, I need your help. Why should the Rock help you? Stephanie has been kidnapped! Why should the Rock care about your Rudy Poo? daughter if you rescue her I'll make sure you get a new title shot it's good enough for me <laughs> oh this guy though can't run while I'm holding the pipe. Oh, apparently the pipe guy over here that wants to go. these guys Vicious dropkick. I'll make sure there's nothing in these boxes that I need. No. Okay, just a weapon. No, stop. That's the achievement for beating stage one. Level two, parking garage. It's great that this game exists. It's great that, like, at some point, this, that someone decided that this, that this was the thing to do. Like, let's put these guys in a game that's not a wrestling game, per se. Like, make a beat em up with these guys, oh, with, with wrestlers, that's... Oh man, I got fucking tased. I 
just don't, I don't care. Killed me. The rock is dead. Savage beating. Wait, what? Why is one of these dudes down here now? Seems unfair. One more try. I don't know if I care enough to get good at this. Ah! Come on! What? seem to kill me. Oh, there we go. All right, and eventually. Zap. All right, that's enough of that. Oh, I can't jump in the hole. I was hoping I could jump and just die. All right, there's... Attitude and WrestleMania 2000. I guess Attitude would probably be the last acclaim game. I kind of played them out of order here. Sorry. I know you care about that. 1999. Ah, Gangrel, created by White Wolf Incorporated. Great. Go to them, too. The title screen's probably the best part about this whole thing. This looks a lot like the last game. It's a shitty look on Triple H's face here. Big roster. No one in the crowd here. Like, hey, you guys want to watch Steve Austin and X Pac wrestle? Nope. We're good. 
just a dark match. I like how that seemed to home in even though I was still moving after he had jumped. Oops, oops, shit. Well, I guess that's as so much of that as we're going to see. WrestleMania 2000, a beloved N64 game, but... What about the Game Boy Color? Natsume. Weird. Uh, these are really useful charts. I'm glad they put them in. Austin, Rock, Ken Shamrock, Val Venus, Jeff Jarrett, Billy Gunn, X-Pac, The Big Show, Triple H, Shawn Michaels, and his like, commissioner garb. Undertaker, Kane. Pretty similar curves here for Undertaker and Kane, if you think about it. Which, you know, at the time makes a lot of sense. Big boss man, handcuffs there. Or dog mankind. Well, I'm, I'm just going to keep being Steve Austin, I guess. Mr. Vince McMahon. Okay. All right. What? Whoa. Censor that is too much. If you, McMahon 360, if you smell what... The, like, a lot of mixed metaphor here. I don't know how I feel about any of that. It's a really edgy Titantron for Road Dog. It's me. It's me. It's D... Oh, double G. Wait a minute. Were they working on a WCW game and then... Like, at the last minute, I was like, oh, well, DDP's not in it, but Road Dog is. Did Road Dog ever say, it's me, it's me, the D O double G? That's not. I'm not crazy, am I? I could be, maybe I'm crazy. I don't know. Just right into it. Just fades up, and a man is walking at you with ill intent. This feels bad. I fucking drop kicked myself out of the ring. Oh boy. Also, more good meters. Why don't fight me, dude? Get back in the ring. How do I get back in the ring? Here's a hot password for you if you want to continue my game from losing the first match. You know, before, before we wrap it up here, there's one more wrestling game I want to play. No, just just not gonna. We just don't get to. We just don't get to play that. Is that how that seems to be working out? Okay. Well, the machine has spoken, and we are done. Yeah, I probably need a new overlay. Maybe 
just put Astron belt behind everything. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Well, okay, yeah, that's that seems to that's never gonna load back up. That's just gone. That app just crashed. That app's just like, cool, thanks, we're done, bye. So cool, thanks, we're done. Bye. <laughs>